more draws, a really big game against Moss, and we got a lot of loan deals coming in, but it's gonna be in a month. game that I played was against Floria and that is a very very disappointing result 0-0 zero, zero. we had let me just check my notes here 30 shots 30 shots 14 of those was on target 0 goals it's very disappointing yeah and the next one, Kvikhallen, they got an early goal and they were dominating us in the first 30, 40 minutes. Then I changed tactic and I changed a couple of things here and there. And uh, then we came back, we came back and we got the result, the draw, but we should probably have done better overall against Kvikhallen. But they were fourth in the league when we were playing them. It is not as bad as the first one. The first one, I mean, these two games, it's, it's not looking good right now. And uh, I can tell you right now, Moss is above us. They are first in the league. Moss is number one. So we really, really need to win this match against them. But we, but, blah, 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 blah. now I'm talking now, Gene, again. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Before we are getting into this match, I need to speak about loans galore yeah we're going to Tromsø and just getting all their players all their second all their players in the second um, team we're getting them <laughs> every single one but they are not coming in before the 8th of August so it's gonna be well a month before they're coming in but there is yeah quite a few players here and um, let's take a look at them so landmark He's coming in. He's gonna be our uh, backup in the fullback area or the complete wingback area. So yeah, I mean, he's probably not gonna be playing that much, but at least we do have the backup now. Um, running again, just a backup central defender. He can play if we need him to. This guy, maybe he. I don't know enough about him yet. I don't know enough about him yet. He, he could potentially be a ball winning midfielder in here. He could potentially be a winger. I don't know. We will see what this guy is all about. Uh, Severinsen. I think he's a decent backup for... Um, as, as a deep line playmaker for... What is his name? I, never, I can never remember his name. Our big star. <laughs> um... Olsen is probably the best of the bunch. I think he'll probably be starting in when he's playing. When 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 uh, when we when he's coming in, I think he will be starting in in the attacking uh, midfield area, uh, or he will start down here um, from time to time as a deep line playmaker. He's very really really well rounded. He he got so good numbers. I mean, his average is probably ten or eleven or something like that. He's really good. And the last one is this guy, and he is also pretty good. He is a winger. So we got some decent cover in the winger area. Could potentially play, play the inside forward over here as well. Do have um, the ability to do that. Definitely. Dribbling 14, technique 12. So that's good. We do have players coming in, but we could use them right now. <laughs> but we're not getting them right now. We need to wait. Um, we need to wait a month before they're coming in. Yeah. So, this game. This game is a big one. Before we're getting into the game, I want to speak about that I changed a couple of things with this tactic here. The attacking midfield tactic. I changed it back to uh, the defensive width going in. Trying to get them in again. And I changed a lot inside the opposition. A couple of things in here have changed. Let's just use this one so you can see what I have changed. Pause it if you want to look at it. A lot have changed in here. And what they basically, what I basically want this to do is again focus them on getting in narrow. And when they are getting in narrow, I'm letting them come in. I'm letting them come into me. And uh, I'm, I'm very, very 
hard on the tackles on the attacking midfielders on the left and right side and yeah and and the wing backs too to to not let them go past me on on the um, on the sides i want them to come in i want them to come into my to my um you know my ball winning midfielder or my box to box midfielder or deep line playmaker or our defensive midfielder i want them to get in there because that is where we are going to get the ball and uh, we're going to press pretty pretty hard on um on the guys uh on the outside to make sure that they get the balls into their midfield so we can so we can get the ball in there because that is where we are going to get the ball um but i don't want to press them i don't want to press i don't want to press uh, what are they called um I don't want to press the mi the midfielders. Actually, this one is actually wrong. I want to tackle him hard. The midfielders, the MC and the defensive midfielders. Well, actually, let's go for hard on that one too. Yeah, there we go. I want I want to tackle them hard when they are getting the ball into the midfield. I want to go for them. I want I want to go tackle them hard. I don't want to press them. I want to let them come up to into our midfield. Well, not the defensive midfielders, but the normal midfielders. I want to let them come into our midfield, just lure them, lure them in, and then tag them and get the ball, and uh, then uh, counter them. When we are out of position, of course. This is all about out of position. So yeah, that is what we're doing. So we are pressing pretty. We're pressing a lot on their uh, defenders as well. Their defenders, we're pressing them. If we can win the ball up high, instead of letting them get into, well, over the top and stuff like that. We, if we can, if we can get the ball up there, we are gonna win the game. So uh, that is what have changed, and that well, it's changed for both the the tactics. And if we can get the ball into the halfback, get the ball into him, he can win it back for us. Now Reggie is gonna be playing the halfback, but he is perfectly he can he can perfectly fine play that role. Bjorkvi is back from injury, so he is ready to play. Mm, yeah, let's let's play with Nikolaisen. I mean, if we're taking a look at Nikolaisen here, his numbers have gone. He was 16 and 16 in acceleration acceleration and pace last year. He has just gone down. I mean, he's done for. He he's not gonna be playing for. Work. He's probably not gonna be around next year, to be honest. I don't think he is. Well, he is actually on... Yeah, he is. He is going to be around, but he's going to be a backup. That's for sure. He's definitely going to be a backup next season. But still a decent backup. He can still play that advanced playmaker role. And he doesn't really need to run that much. He can just play that advanced playmaker role. And he got some decent numbers to do it anyway. And that is what he's going to do this episode as well. And yeah. I, th I think Gorm... I think... Uh, what is it called? Not Gorm. Gamst. His abilities it's also going down mostly the physicals and you know he he is playing his last season here three in accelerate acceleration he's not gonna be around for the next season i don't i don't want someone with two or one in acceleration that's just not even if he got really good abilities over here that is just too much that is just too much and he his wages is way too high as well so let's get into this game really important game i mean did we even look at their tactics? So they're playing 4-2-3-1. Yeah, it's going to be tough. But hopefully this new tactic or this new positioning tactic is going to be working out for us. Um, I am tackling hard on, on on their wingers. So that's the... Yeah, I want to do that. But I actually wanted to... Do I want to press them? I thought I set that up to pressing, but I didn't. I'm not sure. If I press them, they're gonna play the ball down to the midfield. Or up here, where I'm marking this guy is pretty tight. I'm not gonna tackle this guy hard. I'm actually not gonna tackle this guy hard. This is gonna go easy on tackling on this guy. Um. Yeah, I think I wanna I think I wanna go for pressing on the wings. Yeah, let's let's do that. I don't wanna mark them. I don't wanna mark them too tightly. Um Yeah, I don't know why I didn't set that up. It should be actually. Like the midfielders. I, I wanna press them. 
I want to press them into doing something stupid like going into the midfield where we are definitely better. This our our guys in here should be better than most, if not any team in the league. Uh, so that is where we want to get the ball into because we are pretty good with tacklings in here, pretty good with taking takeovers and stuff like that. And we do have the inverted wing back coming into to this area as well. Even when he is defending or coming back, he is in here. So we want them to go in there. Okay. Yeah, we're ready. Let's go. It's 10 minutes in now to this episode. So let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, this is a big game, man. This is a really big game. Just don't lose it, man. Just don't lose it. That is really important that we don't lose this game. That will really hurt our chances of of winning the league. And I mean, if we're not winning the league this season, it's going to be bad next season because we we are in the reds now. We are really in the reds. We need to go up. We need to have a success here. We need to be... We, need, we, we I might even get fired if we are not getting up. Because I'm, I'm getting this... Come on, Nobu. Yeah, that's a good ball. Nicole Eisen. Oh, so close. Oh, Nobu still got it. Back to Reggie. Okay, that's good. Oh, what a ball. Ah, oh, Nelson, Nelson. Come on, man. Need to take your chances. He has not been as good as um what was his name? Oh I'm terrible at names. Remembering names. I'm so terrible at it. But I was right of him last season. He's not been as good as him. But that guy is well yeah, he's not playing. He is on the bench, but he's not really playing. But yeah, we are so much in the red that I am a little bit worried if we're not going up, I might get fired. Because I have not handled the financial situation that good. So we need a win here. We we def Ooh, yeah, good, good. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Well done, Nielsen. Gnome. Nikolaisen into Gamst. Okay, that's good. And over to Abelson. That's a good ball. Can he take the shot? Ah, he shouldn't actually have done that. Maybe he should. He's an inside forward. He should maybe take that chance. Just a little bit narrow, but yeah. I mean, our XG looks quite good here. We did have a couple of good chances. Okay, corner. We do look good here. We It, it seems like what I did seems to be working here. There we go, Reggie. I think that's the first go a real corner goal where we actually get a header and get it in. Really nice from Reggie there. Good corner. Great job. Well done. Yes. Okay, good. We are in here. And they got nothing. They got nothing. Whatever I did, it's working. <laughs> I know what I did, but it seems to be working. Ooh, is this? Ah, no. It's going to go into Like I said, most of the throw-ins when they are when they are in that medium length out, it's going to go to the goalkeeper. But if it's further up the field or if it's um, further down the field then there might be something from pro ends oh this is over the top could milton take it down i think he can oh this might be good uh, mm, he, wow he got <laughs> it hit him oh it, it, the mm, appleton losing it here okay but still we are looking really great here what what a good game for us so far okay He's on a yellow here, Kalasov, so we might have to take him off um, at some point. Ooh, over the top again, and Nilsson is in again. Ah, just wide, just wide. He's a, sometimes he looks a little bit slow with the ball. I'm not sure why, because he's quite quick, and he actually got some good physicals overall. Should be okay with the ball, but maybe his technique is letting him down or something like that. 1.84 in XG. I mean, we need to score some more goals here. Come on, guys. Ooh. Okay. It might be a counter. Or maybe we can get it back. No, it's a counter. And we're letting them outside. I don't want to see that. Uh, he's just... Oh, this guy is quick. Wow, he's moving so fast. And he's not going to find his man, but... Sort of did find him anyway. Okay, that's a good block. That's a good block. I mean, I'm not. I don't like to give them a corner, but um, I think we're quite decent at corners. 
then, then they're gonna score now, right? No. <laughs> well, not in the first try. Here comes the second try. Ooh, that's... Oh, no! So they did score from that corner, but it was not really the corner that did it. Um, terrible. Their first chance, or maybe their second... No, it is their first chance at goal, and they score. I mean, can't really do nothing about it. We just need to outscore them. We just need to score more goals now. It's not. It's, it's even a 0 0.09 chance. I mean... Okay, come on. Can we get the second ball here? No. Wow, he... Mm, that guy is so... It's really good. Nope. Ooh! Nielsen, you got to put this away. He's not putting enough away. One-on-ones, he's not putting enough away. He, he needs to be better. <sighs> I mean, a draw would not be terrible, but really with the numbers we're seeing here, we should absolutely beat them. At home, we should beat them. We already beaten them once this season. We need to beat them again. This is our biggest opponent right now. We need to beat them. Come on, Reggie, do something good here. No, Gamst over to Nikolaisen, but it's too far and it's, yeah, end of the highlight and end of first half. We need to score again. We are 2.11 in XG. We need to score again here. We got, again, six on target. We need to, I mean, in training, I do actually train them with conversion right now to make more conversion from what they're doing and... I mean, I need to see it. I need to see. I need to see more goals because that uh, against Broden is uh, really what changed the season. We do not have Broden playing. We have Nilsson, and Nilsson is just not really doing everything that he possibly could do to give us a chance here. Or, or, or he's not taking his chances. He is missing way too much. Where Broden was just, he was just killing it last season. What is this? Okay, we're backing off like we should. And then we are pressing up on their uh, backs, wing backs and wingers here. Okay, good. Oh, this is over the top. No, please. No, that's not fair. Okay, okay. We got, we got it. He's offside. That would not have been fair. That would have been so unfair. Come on, guys. We need... I mean... We're not really getting any chances right now. To think about that. Do have Reggie and Colossus on yellow. That's not too good. So Nilsson is playing okay, but I don't... I mean, I don't really see that. He's missing his chances, but... I mean, he is a better player than Broden. But who can we... I mean, Bjorkvi could possibly come on here for Nikolaisen, but again, Nikolaisen is doing... Where is he? He's here. He's having a good game. Reg is having a good game, probably, but he also deserved that yellow. I don't really know here. Should probably take Kolosovs off. For Olsen. So our midfield are not doing that well here. Gnome is not doing that well. Gams uh, probably not have the best. Um, what can we do? We can go over to this tactic and look for the goal. That is possible. And we can bring... Yeah, I mean, we should... Ah, it's, it's a little bit... It's a little bit dangerous to do this. Um, I definitely need to ease him off tackles. I can't do that when he's a ball winning midfielder. That's very dangerous to do this. I could make him a box to box instead. Or maybe something else. Central midfielder on defend. Can I then take off tackle hard? Yeah, I can. Good. Let's do that instead. Ease him off tackles with central midfielder role. And bring no more for um, Bjorkvi. Or maybe Jakobsen. Or Thomason. I mean, Thomason have not shown me anything. He doesn't deserve to come on. I think we're putting Bjorkvi on.
Hmm. Yeah, let's let's try that. Let's try that. I mean, I need to do something here. Wait, hold what? I missed I missed a goal because I was doing stuff. How can I see that goal? Can you please allow me to see that goal? Nielsen scored. Okay, please let us see that goal. I completely missed it. That's a pretty lucky goal, but also a pretty good goal. Okay, now we know that. So we are 2-1 up. Should I go back on my things I have done in here? I can't do that actually. It's already done. Right. <laughs> well, move on then. Oh, that's my this might be a this might be a bad thing then. Okay, cancel. Oh, okay, okay. Ah, oh, okay. Well, at least hmm, 2-1 up, but we are Okay, that's Bjorkvi. Good, 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 very good. He's coming on and doing some bits here for us. Okay, that's over the top to Appleson, and that's an Ah, oh, it's a nice play. It's a nice play. Uh, just the the end product was just yeah from Nilsson, but I he already scored, so I can't complain too much about him in this game. Okay, long throw from Nilsson. It's gonna be to no one, but we're picking up the second ball, I think. No, we're not. Wow, we had so many men there. Hmm. Please don't let them go outside. Don't let them go outside. Let it, yeah, that's good. Hard tackle. Exactly what I wanted to see. Over the top and Nilsson might be in here. It's very narrow, but he's alone. He's gonna shoot. Okay, get the corner. Good. Like Bruden last year. If he's not getting the shot on, he's gonna get the corner. <laughs> Good. And let's see. We did already get one corner goal, but we're not getting it this time around. But we do get a throw, but it's not a highlight, unfortunately. But uh, this... I mean... Being in front here is really important because we are definitely winning three points and they are losing three points here. But they are really struggling. I mean, if they... Uh, it's too narrow again. He should, he should cut it back. He should cut it back. But I mean, he is an inside forward and I want to play something else than inside forward over there. I want a wide midfielder. Uh, no, not a wide midfielder. I want a um, target man. I want a target man over there. At some point, at some point I want a target man. But right now he's an inside forward. He's gonna shoot. He's gonna shoot. Okay, so comes with a free kick and we should make a sub right after this highlight. That was not the highlight. More to come here. Out to Gamst again. What is he gonna do? Inside to Nielsen and that's a goal but it's disallowed. Let's make this sub here. Should probably take Reggie off to be honest. Um... It's a little bit dangerous to have him on. Don't really have a good option to bring on here, but I guess Thomason can play some sort of role down here. I'm not sure which role it could be. Mm, probably box to box, to be honest. Not the best thing, but he just needs to play there for 12 minutes. Okay, um, let's hope for the best here. Let's hope for our highlight here. Good, that was a good hitter from Nilsson. Nikolaisen up to Bjorkvi. He might be in, he might be in here. Bit narrow, but I think he got the corner maybe. No. Seems to be hitting him back after that. Okay. But at least it was a highlight for us. So, four minutes to go here. I mean, this is a really important win. We are getting back into... Actually, look at that. 20 shots, 9 on target. We should be sure, We should get one more goal here, to be honest. Oh, no. I could see it already before it happened. That's a nice block. It's not over. It's not over. That's a nice block as well. Good. Okay. That was the highlight. I'm happy with that. It's not. <laughs> it's not over. Demand more. Wow, my assistant is gonna demand more. That's that's really nice interception there from Antonsen. Good. But I think I think they. Yes, it's the end of the highlight. How did you like that? I actually. Uh, ooh, here we go, Nielsen. 
Yeah, he, he's supposed to be there. I definitely need to change that. Okay. Uh, Gamst into Nikolaisen. He's pretty open here. What can he do? He's gonna get the corner. Good. Good. Waste a little bit of time with the corner. Good. Not that we are time wasting at all, but just getting the corner is fine. Gamst. Nope. Nope. Not hitting anyone. Thomason picking it up. And he's gonna round his man here. Okay, that's good. Can he get... Yeah, that's fine. Just... Okay. And we're picking up the second ball, so... Oh, maybe not. Oh, Appleton is too slow. This guy, Scorn, I think he got... How much pace does he got? 16, 17, something like that. He's pretty pacey. Good game. We won it. I mean, we should have scored one more goal, but... Can't really complain too much. We won a really important game here. A really important game. Let's get out of it. Good. We are five unbeaten. That's at least a good thing. But many of them were draws, so that's not too good. Um, Where are we in the league? Funny enough, number one again. So we are three points clear of them now. Good. Very good. But, um, yeah. It's still gonna be tough. Look at this. Kongsvinger. They are one game behind. And they earn 23 points. Like we expected from the get-go of this season. We expected Kongsvinger to be our biggest rival. And they might still be. They might still be that. Skid. They are not really that close. I mean, they do have a couple of games in hand, so they could come back. They could come back. But I'm a little bit more worried about Kongsvinger here. Let's take a look at the schedule. I haven't looked at it. We do have Skid here, so that's a pretty big game. And we should probably show that. We also got Kongsvinger, so I think I should I think I should come back for Skid. I think we should play that game. Right, guys? I think that's a good idea. That is the end of this episode. And in the next episode, we are going to play Skeed. And hopefully we can find another win against them. Because they are having two games in hand. So if they are winning that game, they could potentially go top of the league after winning against us. We don't want that. Stick around. So see if we can do it.